Hello friends, this is Ramna. Today we will discuss one important SQL literary question and show practically how to resolve the problem in this demo. So what is the question here? So how to get the distinct values from a table without using the distinct keyword in SQL? So this is, the, is a common interview question in recent past in many interviews for any question, SQL developer and data analyst question. So first I am showing my table. This is the player player data. It contains some duplicates. So total number of uh, records in this table is 15, 15 rows. So if you apply the uh, distinct key, keyword in this table, so it, it will get only unique records. That is eight records. And so remaining seven records are duplicate. Now uh, I am showing the in this demo without using the distinct keyword how to get the records how to get the unique records first time using the union method so what union is doing you know when union will combining the records of the two tables and get the only unique records so initially we have 10 records now after applying the union records i got just Eight records. So this is different to the uninal. If you apply the uninal in, in the same query, you will get 30 records. It will double. So this is how union uninal will work. So union is one method to get the distinct records. And second one uh, I am using here is row number function. Row number function I am using now. Uh, comma. Row now, row number uh, over partition by ID order by ID. So I am giving some alias name called RN. And on top of it, I am writing one more query. Select star from. So within the parentheses, I am uh, I am making this query as sub query. I am giving the uh, table name, derived table name as temp. Now I am writing the where condition here. Where Rn, we already given one uh, alias name. Rn is equal to 1. Turn to get just 15 records. Now after executing the uh, row num function, we will get 8 records. See here, 8 records. If you don't want to show uh, all these. Uh, uh, Rn uh, uh, last number uh, rank function. If you if you don't don't want to show uh, rank in the display, then you, you have to write just id first name last name and country and execute this one. Then you will get exactly what you want. This is the second method. First method is union method and second method is the row number method. Now, third method is a very popular method. It is a group by. So here I am using the third method. I am selecting the column for first name, last name and country. In group B also, we need to take all the columns in this uh, select class. Group by and copying the all these four columns. Now, if you run, if 
team records. Now, if you run the group by method, you will get eight records. So this is the third method. And last method I want to show here is the intersect. Intersect operator. I am using this on between the two tables. I am using intersect operator. 15 records after applying the intersect. One minute, spelling is wrong. You will get 8 records. So, you, you can get the distinct values without using the distinct method in four ways. First is union, and second is row number by using row number and third one is group by fourth one is intersect intersect operator so by these four methods you can get the distinct values without using the distinct keyword hope this video helped to understand about the about this entire question thanks for watching the video thank you very much